Hey everyone, how are you? I'm Sabine again. What's up guys? How are you doing? Quarantine is already over, thanks to God. So what are your plans for it? Are you gonna celebrate it or not? It's just nothing for you. So please let me know, you can comment below. In today's video, I want to talk about some brand names. So let's learn them. <laughs> Most of you love doing shopping, but unfortunately these names, I mean brand names, might be sometimes quite difficult to pronounce because most of them belong to French, like French companies, and that's why it might be quite difficult to pronounce. Okay, so let's get started. Our first word, our first brand name is this one. Do you love it? Actually it's quite famous all around the world. I'm pretty sure you know it, or one of your friends have this car. And how do you pronounce it in English? So it's pronounced like Mercedes. Mercedes. So I know most of you can pronounce like Mercedes or Merce Mercedes. And like this. So, but actually it's pronounced like Mercedes. Mercedes. Great. Rest and voice control for when you want to speak your mind. Hey Mercedes. What would you like to do? How far to the airport? And the second one, of course, if we've mentioned this one, we have to mention this one as well. So it's pronounced like BMW. Of course, I'm talking about America. In America, we prefer to pronounce it like BMW, but uh, most of people can pronounce like BMW. It's no problem, like BMW. It's also possible to pronounce it like BMW, but normally in America, we prefer to say BMW, okay? I'm a trainer and an instructor at the BMW Driving Experience and we are right here at the heart of the BMW Driving Experience Academy in Mysa. We have this famous, famous, like one of my favorite brands. This is this one. <clears throat> you will be shocked. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure about it. So most of the people can pronounce it like Nike. Actually all around the world we pronounce it like Nike. But unfortunately, in America, it's pronounced like Nike. I don't know why. And Chaffetz, a bit earlier with us today, reacting on that Nike decision to recall the new Betsy Ross flag. America. And what Nike is doing is engaging in this effort that is... And the next one would be this brand. I know it's also very famous, one of the famous brands. And how do you pronounce it? Actually, this is a French brand. That's why you have to keep that pronunciation, that... French pronunciation and we pronounce it like Yves Rocher. NTH Global. Yves Rocher, act beautiful. So, and the next one is this. So, it is pronounced like Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton. Why? Because it's again French and we pronounce it like Louis Vuitton, not Louis Vuitton or Louis Vuitton. <laughs> it's like Louis Vuitton. Okay. Cody Fern and I'm here for the Louis Vuitton show. This and the last one would be this one. I know many of you love it. And actually, I don't recommend you to eat fast food. You should keep away from it. But if you love, okay, I can't say anything. Especially after quarantine, you must be missing getting McDonald's. No, oh, I've already said it. So it's not McDonald's. It's not, I don't know, McDonald without this. It's pronounced like McDonald's, McDonald's, okay? McDonald's. Do you love McDonald's? Yes, I do. Great. At McDonald's. <laughs> the new bacon smokehouse burger. It's the newest flavor of the signature crafted recipes by McDonald's. So guys, thanks for your attention. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you found it quite interesting. I want you to practice these words at home when you see them in the street. Please pay attention to their names, to their pronunciations. Thanks for all of you. See you soon. Bye-bye.